movies and beer. Beer and movies. They kind of they kind of go hand in hand. Uh, the wisest wizards, uh, they're always drinking beer, you know. So, um, yeah. I'm coming from uh, coming from coming what? Um, yeah, I'm filming this. I'm filming this review on my back porch, which I love. A lot of people say that it's scary, um, but, you know, I moved, I moved a futon out here, uh, to sit on and stare at nature. Because nature is beautiful. Movie review. Uh, it's that time of year, you know, summer, summer's coming quick, and, you know, it's the end of the school year. Basically... Um, if you, uh, you're not doing well in school by now, you're, you're fucked. Fucked. So I'm going to do my review on summer school, this fantastic 80s movie. Uh, I actually, I enjoyed this movie every time it was, uh, kind of, like, came on, uh, the TV when I was younger. TBS. Always on TBS. Uh, I'd have to watch it. Uh, it's, uh, Christy Alley is in this. Skinny, skinny Christy Alley. Uh, you know, when she was the hottie from Cheers and whatnot. Um, and, uh, the Courtney, Courtney Thorne Smith or whatever. This, this girl, can you see her? Mm hmm Yeah. Uh, she's in Melrose Place. The recent, uh, I Love Jim or something like that. Uh, with Jim Belushi and and she looks the same. She looks beautiful. I I hope that happens when I'm older. Up, oh, the light always goes off filming this for my laptop. Um. Anyway, this this is a special edition uh, DVD uh, that was purchased uh, for me at Blockbuster. It came with an awesome I Love '80s Music CD and two free downloads. Yeah, and I think it was like five bucks or something like that. Anyway, I digress. The movie is about... Uh, summer school? I think, I think that's what it's about. Yeah. I'm going to be truthful. I have attended summer school um, in college uh, on purpose. But uh, when I was a freshman in high school, I did fail uh, some stuff, two subjects. Uh, but that was not because I was, you know didn't know what was going on is because I was basically lazy um and yeah this just reminds me of that time um so it's like a bunch of students all random you know there's the the football player jock guy there's the pregnant girl there's uh, the dyslexic girl you know I'm I'm dyslexic you know I don't relate to that character I actually my favorite character is Chainsaw in, in this movie, because that's who I would be friends with in high school, the horror movie geeks and, and nerds. Um, there's the foreign exchange student, the beautiful foreign exchange student, uh, the surfer girl, which is the chick from Melrose Place, um, and, you know, Mr. Shoop is the, the teacher, this, this guy, he's in a lot of 80s movie stuff, and the dog, I like that dog. <laughs> I wish I could get my dog to wear sunglasses and a lay. That, he had a lay on the other day, but uh, it didn't last very long. It's an awesome movie. This, this is going uh, very long, and I'm sorry for that, because um, I wasn't really like prepared on what exactly I wanted to talk about. Comedy. You know, your typical 80s. There's like a music montage thing where they're like, at the end, they're taking the exam. You know, to whether or not they pass summer school and graduate, I think it is. Um, there's, you know, the beach scene. Everybody goes to the beach. There's the jail scene, you know. It's a typical, your typical 80s movie. But you know what? The 80s, they, they dressed pretty not so nice. And there's some weird haircuts and whatnot. But uh, they, don't, they don't dress too bad in, in this movie. But 80s movies, they were pretty much all good. Um, the Chainsaw Guy, he's in another movie, Ski School. 
uh, which I actually, I, I enjoyed that one as well. Um, another one of those 80s movies. Um, but, yes, check this out. Uh, if you haven't seen it already, probably a lot of you have. It's always on TV in the summer. Uh, it's funny. There's a great uh, comedy horror scene in it where all the students kind of, like, gore themselves up to scare uh, another teacher. Um, but it's basically a, uh, you know, growing, growing with yourself and loving yourself and, you know, that you're able, you know, you, you could do it kind of movie. So, yes, and that has been my review for Tuesday on The Rough Cuts here from my back porch. Cheers. See you next Tuesday. Cut. I'm bringing it back, bitch. I'm bringing it back. Tension breaker had to be done.